what distinguishes Indian food is its magical use of spices. I always loved food. And what I perhaps didn't know is that I had a very good palate because everything that I was eating as a child, I somehow reported. India is a vast country. It's the size of Europe. And this variety of food that we have is what makes Indian food Indian, not curry. I don't think we had such a word until the British came to India. It stood in their mind for all Indian food. How can you take all that food and call it all curry? If you know nothing about Indian food, you take this class just to learn. Isn't it fun to find out what they do in other parts of the world? I'm going to talk about spices. Nobody knows spices like we do. We are masters. I will show you how to make Indian breads, how to cook a lot of the vegetables and meats. Then we'll make street food. I often serve this as my first course to get the juices going. Just delicious. When you cook rice, each grain should be like brothers, close to each other, but not stuck to each other. I call mustard seeds the Jekyll and Hyde of spices. They can be very spicy and pungent and hot, or if you pop them in hot oil, they turn sweet and nutty. Eating is such an important part of our lives. It really tells you who you are in many ways, what you eat, how you eat it, what your culinary traditions are. It tells me a lot about the people of that country. So if you want to know, what 1.4 billion people are doing with their lives, how they live. Come, watch this class, and you'll get a good idea. I'm Madhur Jafri, and this is Masterclass.